Listen to me, Jolly. Fa la 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 la. Don't we know our gay apparel? Fa la 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 la. Through the ancient Yuletide carol. Fa la 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 la. Fast away the old year passes. Fa la 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 la. Hail the new year, lads and lasses. Fa la 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 la. Sing we joyous all together. Fa la 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 la. Heedless of the wind and weather. Fa la 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 la. Fa la 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 la. Franklin, why don't you get those last few presents for me? <laughs> All right. <laughs> Franklin, where are those parcels, Franklin? Coming, Dad. Oh. Can't forget you, Sam. Up you go. Hey! Whoa. Harriet! Look what you made me do! Yipsie! <laughs> hey, you two, no time for games. Your mother's right. We want to get to Grandma and Grandpa's before lunchtime. Anything else? Just that Christmas fruit fly cake and we're all set. Back in a jiffy. But, Mom, we still have to wait for Bear. He's taking care of Goldie, remember? I remember. Honey, where's that cake? It should be on the counter. Hold on, I'll show you. And Franklin, don't forget the presents. Aw, gee. Hmm. You can help too, Harriet. Okay. Now bring him over here. Uh-uh. Mine! Harriet. <laughs> hey, Sam's mine! <laughs> Come on. Come back here, you. Oh, no, you don't. Gotcha! <laughs> Way to go, Bear! <laughs> Franklin to the rescue! <clears throat> Morning, Mr. and Mrs. Turtle. Morning, Bear, Beatrice. I thought you were going to take care of these presents, Franklin. Harriet started it! She... Franklin? You're older than her. You have to set an example. Now get Goldie, okay? But... <sighs> okay... This scarf should keep her nice and warm. Be good, okay, Goldie? <laughs> I can't believe you're not going to be here for Christmas. I know. Franklin, time we headed off. Okay, Mom. Bye, Bear. Thanks for looking after Goldie for me. Merry Christmas, Franklin. Merry Christmas, Bear. See you in the new year. Bye, Harriet. Bye. <gasps> Sam! Franklin, wait! You forgot Sam! Franklin! Bye, Bear! Bye! Buckle up, Franklin. Okay.
wait to see Grandma and Grandpa's farm again. <sighs> we do yet. <laughs> Car ride a little boring, Harriet? Mom, have you seen Sam? I thought you had him. I was carrying him with all those presents and... <gasps> you took Sam and left him in the snow. Dad, stop the car. We have to turn back and get Sam. I'm sorry, Franklin. We're already late as it is. But Sam's probably freezing. Tell you what, you can call Bear when we get to the farm. Good idea. I'm sure he'll find Sam for you. All right. Franklin mad? Of course I'm mad. Why can't you leave my stuff alone? Now, Franklin, there's no need to be so cross. Your sister's sorry. Sorry. Oh, brother. Uh-huh. Lincoln did better. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. I'm your big brother. They're here. Merry Christmas! <gasps> Merry Christmas to you, too. <laughs> Welcome back to Far Away Farm. Thanks, Dad. It's good to be back. Grandma! Grandpa! Frankie, wait! Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, Grandpa. <laughs> Grandma to the rescue. Grandma! <laughs> Good to see you, Mom. How's my favorite son-in-law? Fine. Just fine. Franklin, when'd you get so big? <gasps> As you wish. Oh. Whee! So, there's three whole days to Christmas. What should we do first? How about lunch? I've got soup on. Oh, boy, I love soup. Me, too. Come along, then. Franklin, wasn't there something you had to do? Oh, yeah. May I use your phone first? I have to call my friend Bear. Sure. Phone's in the hall. Nobody's home. Up you go. You can try again later. No luck with your friend. Come on, I'll show you your room. Oh, boots off before you come upstairs. My old room. It looks just like I remember it. Whiskers. Ah. Hello, Whiskers. <gasps> Harriet! My bed! My bed! My bed! Oh, I don't have to share, do I? I've never had to share my room. But I thought you'd like bunking with your sister. I'm sure it won't be a problem. Right, Franklin? Oh, all right. <laughs> Franken, Franken. <laughs> Dashing through the snow in a one-horse open sleigh, o'er the fields we go, laughing all the way. <laughs> Bells on bobtails ring, making spirits bright. What fun it is to ride and sing a sleighing song tonight. Oh, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh. Hey, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse
horse open sleigh. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one horse open sleigh. <laughs> well done. Bravo. Oh, my stars. You won't believe what I found. Our old Christmas album. Who wants to take a look with me? I do. Me, me. Ouch, Harriet. I got here first. There's room enough for both of you. I'm going to get my camera. Here, you sit on my lap so Franklin can snuggle in a little closer. Good. This album holds all our Christmas photographs. Lots of fond memories there. <laughs> years and years of memories. I grew up on Faraway Farm, you know. And when your grandma and I got married, I came to live here. A few years later, your mom was born. This is a special place. There's your mom with Rosie. <laughs> ah, the princess and her pony. Oh, stop. Oops. Mom, is this you too? <laughs> no, Franklin, that's me. <gasps> Grandma Little. You look so sad. Something happened that Christmas, or, or, or I think something happened that was... Very unusual. Unusual? I don't think I've heard this story. Me neither. Well, I haven't thought about it for years, but seeing this photo again... This was a long time ago, mind you, a few days before my seventh Christmas. My father and I were out in the forest, searching for the perfect Christmas tree. I had a mind of my own, being an only child, and I wandered deeper into the woods. Walking alone through the forest on that crisp winter morning, I didn't have a care in the world. snow. A simple silver bell. A bell? Go ding dong? <laughs> yes. And the sound it made was more beautiful than anything I've heard since. wasn't sure anyone else would either. Oh, there you are. Didn't you hear me call you? I've never told this to anyone before, but that reindeer didn't run away. He flew away. Wow! The reindeer flew? Like the wind. Then again, I might have imagined the whole thing. What happened to the bell? I must have hidden it away. Haven't seen it since. What's that you're sitting in, Mom? Remember that beautiful sleigh your grandfather made? <laughs> Is that old thing still in the barn? Collecting dust. I've been meaning to fix it up. Take my favorite turtle for a ride. Oh, you. 
There's nothing finer than taking a sleigh ride on Christmas Day. Look, it's Sam. He was the first Christmas present you and Grandpa ever gave me. Where is Sam, anyway? You two have always been together. Harriet loved Sam. You mean Harriet lost Sam. Family portrait time. Everyone by the tree. Franklin and Harriet at the front, please. Hold Harriet's hand, Franklin. <sighs> Another Christmas memory for the album. On the count of three, everyone say Christmas tree. One, two, three. Christmas, Christmas tree! tree! First star I see tonight. It's a beautiful night for stargazing. That one's brighter than all the others. That one's Sirius. If you're ever looking for woodland, all you have to do is follow Sirius. Some call it the dog star. He's blue, just like Sam. Then how about we nickname Sirius Sam Star? Are you worried about Sam? He's never spent the night outside by himself. Harriet shouldn't have taken him. I'm sure Harriet never meant to cause any trouble. She's still learning. And she really looks up to her big brother. But she's always following me around and playing with my stuff. Sometimes I wish I never had a little sister. Oh, Franklin. You know that story I told you about the reindeer? Well, I wish that I'd had a little sister with me that day. Then she would have seen that reindeer too, right? I believe you saw it, Grandma. <laughs> I know you do. <sighs> now, how about we get you back into bed? But I'm not sleepy. Tell you what, I'll sing to you just like I did when you were little. Okay. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. Up above the world so high, like a diamond in the sky. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. Good night, Franklin. Good night, Grandma. Good night, Sam Star. You able to get in touch with your friend Bear this morning? No. Mom thinks they're probably out Christmas shopping. Morning, you two. Morning. Hello there. Hi, Grandpa. You remember Rosie, don't you, Franklin? Good morning, Rosie. Harriet and I are going to check the mailbox for Christmas cards. Right, little one? <laughs> Looks like we're on our way. See you later. Can you keep a secret, Franklin? Sure, Grandma. What is it? I'll show you. I've never been in this part of the barn before. This is Grandpa's workshop. Wow! A sleigh! 
<laughs> Your grandpa's always wanted to take a Christmas sleigh ride, so I'm fixing it up to surprise him. Oh, yeah. That's a great idea. He's talked about doing it for years, but never got around to it. Say, would you like to help me? Really? Of course. Two pairs of hands are better than one, you know. But remember, Franklin, it's a surprise. It'll be our very own secret sleigh. <laughs> we'll sand down the wood and tomorrow polish her up. And the sleigh will be ready for Christmas Day. You betcha. Afternoon. Oh, hello there. Franklin, meet our neighbors, Mr. and Mrs. Collie. Hello, Franklin. Hi. <gasps> Your horses don't bite, do they? Not unless you're a carrot or a sack of oats. <laughs> we got the wood polish you wanted. It should make that sleigh look as good as new. I thought our sleigh was a secret. I couldn't sneak out without your grandpa suspecting. How could I? Don't worry. Your secret's safe with us. Have you heard? Radio says there's an ice storm due tonight. Oh, a bad one. Oh, dear. I didn't know. You'd best get going, then. Give us a call if you need to borrow one of the horses. <laughs> Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! Merry, Merry Christmas. Christmas! Let's get inside and make some hot chocolate. It sure must be cold. Even the trees are shivering. Trees shivering? Well... Horse, hens, and cows are all tucked up nice and warm in the barn. Grandpa! Here's my little one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure glad to be back inside. It's so cozy in here with the roaring fire and the Christmas lights all... ...off. Wow! A blackout! Storm must have knocked out the power lines. I'll go get us some flashlights. Mm. The phone's not working either. <gasps> I haven't talked to Bear yet. Sorry, Franklin. None of us can make a call until the phone is working. But what about Sam? Where's Sam? Sam's out in the storm, remember? We'd better get ready for a cold night. Harriet... You help me find some extra blankets. Okay. Good. Franklin, there should be candles in the attic closet. Oh. Come on. It'll be like camping indoors. Okay. Let's see. Candles. Aha! Uh -huh. Here they are. <gasps> oh, it's you, Whiskers. Is there something you want in there? Yeah. That's Grandma when she was little. Hey! <laughs> what you got there? Huh? 
This must be Grandma's bell. Wait till she sees this. It'll be perfect for Grandpa's sleigh. <laughs> no, Whiskers. Someone might hear. We want to keep this a surprise. Some storm, huh, Whiskers? is completely iced over. Not that anything on four wheels could get very far today. Far away farms become frozen farm. <laughs> Careful, Harriet. Why don't you help me sprinkle sand on the driveway? Okay. Look, me make snow. <laughs> That's right. <gasps> We sure could use another hand out here. Have you seen Franklin this morning? Heading outside? Oh, Grandma, I thought I was gonna get caught. Caught? With this. I don't believe it. So I really did find a bell all those years ago. I found it in the attic closet. Won't it look great on Grandpa's sleigh? Oh, Franklin, that's a lovely idea. I wonder if it still makes that beautiful sound. Wait, we don't want Grandpa to hear it. Right. I'll get Grandpa to start lunch. Meet you in the barn. Franklin? Yes, Dad? Where are you off to in such a hurry? Um, I'm doing something for Grandpa. Well, would you mind looking after your little sister for a while? It would really help us out, Franklin. Looks the same as the day I found it. Won't need more than a bit of polishing. Pretty. <laughs> Very pretty. Isn't it nice that Harriet's here, Franklin? Yeah, great. Oh, come on, Mr. Sourpuss. This'll be fun, the three of us together. Ding dong bell. <gasps> Harriet, no! No ding dong? No ding dong. Harriet, if you ring the bell, Grandpa might hear it, and he'll know about the sleigh. You don't want to spoil the secret, do you? <gasps> secret. Shh. Now give Franklin the bell, and you can help Grandma polish the sleigh, okay? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Not like that. Grandma, why does she get to help? I thought this was going to be our secret. We can use all the help we can get. Christmas is tomorrow, you know. But anyone would be better than Harriet. Winking pretty. <laughs> <sighs> Yummy. Harriet, those flies are for the salad. Okay. Just in time for lunch. This chili should chase the cold away. It's my secret recipe. Secret? Me gotta... Have another fly. 
Here you are. We were wondering, Mom. I think we should check in on the collies? Make sure they're coping after the storm. We could take the skis and be back before dinner. That's a good idea. I'll put together some provisions to take with you. Won't be long. Could I go with you, Dad? Uh-uh, Franken. Gotta finish secret. What's this about a secret? Secret sleigh. Aww. Franklin, we're fixing up that old sleigh in the barn. It was going to be a surprise until somebody opened her big mouth. It's all right, Franklin. Grandpa's the one we're surprising. It's not fair. Here we go. All done, Franklin? I lost my appetite. I thought everyone loved my chili. Got everything you need? All set. We'll be back by dinner. You be good now. Do you have to go, Dad? It's Christmas Eve. All the more reason to check on the collies, Franklin. We're depending on you to take care of things until we get back. You are? That's right. Take good care of Grandma and Grandpa now. Sure, Mom. And watch over Harriet. Take care. Bye-bye. Wish the Collies a Merry Christmas for us. We will. Bye. Bye. Lincoln? Mom and Dad said I'm in charge, so you better stay out of trouble. Don't touch anything. Ding dong bell. <gasps> Harriet, no! Franklin! Grandpa! Oh, oh, oh. <gasps> Grandpa! Are you okay? Uh, it's my leg. Grandpa broke? Uh, I'm afraid so. Oh, oh, oh. It could be a sprain or even broken. Well, it hurts, that's for sure. <laughs> it's okay, Harriet. Hush, little one. Oh, oh, dear. You've got quite a bump here. Do you feel dizzy? No, just klutzy. I'm sorry, Grandpa. Mom asked me to take care of you and Grandma. Now, Franklin, it was an accident. Simple as that. How about we let Grandpa rest for a spell? Why don't you two play quietly in your room? Grandma fixed Grandpa? Oh, I'll do my best. still isn't working. They should have been back by now. 
What if they decided to stay at the Collies for the night? How are we going to get help? You need to see a doctor as soon as possible. If only Dr. Bear was here. She'd know what to do. Lincoln? What do? I'm just going out to check on Grandpa's sleigh. I'll be right back. You stay here. I mean it this time, okay? That's it, girl. I need you to take me somewhere. There. That should do it. I hope. to woodland as fast as you can. <laughs> This doesn't look familiar. Are we going the right way? If only I could see Sirius, then I'd know which way to go. We there yet? Harriet? <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> Franklin! Harriet? Hey, you two! <gasps> oh, my stars! Uh, what is it? It's the children. They're gone. Gone? Where could they go? Dear Grandma and Grandpa, I'm going to Woodland to get Dr. Bear. Children. Hi, we're back. Everything's fine up at the Collies. What's happened? Now what am I going to do? We're lost. Lincoln? Me help? You've done enough. Lincoln cross? Yes, I'm cross. You scared Rosie away. Why'd you have to go and follow me anyway? You never do what you're told. <laughs> hey, don't cry. I'm sorry I yelled at you. It's just... Because of me, Grandpa got hurt, and now we're stuck in the middle of nowhere. Some Christmas. Lincoln? Grandma's bell? 
What can I do with that? Hmm. That reindeer appeared right after you rang this bell, didn't it? Ding dong? Remember Grandma's story? The same thing happened to her when she was little. Reindeer fly. That's right. So maybe if we ring it now... Reindeer come? ...to take us to Woodland. Ding dong. Ding dong. Dear. Guess not. Look! Reindeer fly! I think this bell belongs to you. That's why you come when someone rings it. Can you help us, please? My grandpa needs a doctor, so we need to get to Woodland fast. Great! But how are we going to harness these reindeer? Are you ready to go? Giddy up! Hold on tight! <laughs> Look! They're serious! That's the way to Woodland! Grandma and I named it Sam Star. Isn't it beautiful? Pretty. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. How I wonder what you are. Up above the world so high. Like a diamond in the sky. Twink. As your bright and tiny spark lights the traveler in the dark. Though I know not what you are, twinkle on, please, little star. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. Who's ready for some stew? Me, please. Ah, <gasps> reindeer! And they're pulling a sleigh. Hey, it's Franklin. We'll split up. Maybe we can find out which way they went. <laughs> It's Rosie. Franklin must have taken her. But where could they be? Oh, my stars. Look.
I don't believe it. Franklin. Harriet. Thank goodness you're all safe. We go flying. <laughs> so you did. This way, Dr. Bear. My father's taken quite a spill. Of course, lead the way. Grandma? Hello again. Remember me? your bell back. <gasps> we definitely want this in the Christmas album. I'm all set. Reindeer have a lot to do tonight. Santa Claus? Maybe. Reindeer fly. That's right. Does your leg still hurt, Grandpa? Not a bit. Your grandpa's going to be just fine. Thanks to Dr. Bear and Franklin. Harriet helped too, right? Right! Oh, I almost forgot. I have something for Franklin. Oh, <gasps> Sam! Thanks, Dr. Bear. Oh, don't thank me. Thank your friend, Bear. Look, Harriet, Sam! It's okay, you can play with him. Okay. But I want him back by bedtime. There's only so much sharing a big brother can do. Christmas, Lincoln. Merry Christmas, Harriet. Mm -hmm. 